distinguished scientists, ladies, gentlemen, and everyone attending 2017 World Sustainability and Emerging Sustainability Leader Awards Gala Dinner tonight. Good evening. First and foremost, I would like to thank MDPI Sustainability Foundation and World Sustainability Awards Selection Committee chaired by Professor Max for selecting me as one of the recipients of Emerging Sustainability Leader Award. I am humbled and honored. Thank you. I am Esther Ngumbi. I grew up in a farming community in Kenya. At the age of seven, I tried farming. My parents, who were teachers and farmers as well, gave me a strip of land along the river on which I planted cabbages. Every day, I went to watch their progress. And slowly, the cabbages came up, green and vibrant. Then one day, the rains came and kept coming. And the river rose higher and higher until it flooded out the cabbages and destroyed my small farm patch. I was devastated. Where I grew up, farming was hard. The soil was unhealthy. We battled insects and poor rainfall, and often ended up with no harvest, which meant we were hungry. But we kept at it. Farming was our livelihood, whatever the challenges. These experiences and challenges inspired me to pursue a career in agriculture. Today, I'm a researcher at the Department of Entomology, Auburn University. And my main goal is to develop sustainable pathways to increased food productivity by Africa's smallholder farmers. Only in this way can we end hunger once and for all. I believe that sustainability issues like hunger and food insecurity affect all of us, and that each generation and individual, including you and I and everyone watching my speech tonight, has a role to play. I have stepped up to do my part, both as a food security advocate and a researcher. For the last eight years, I have pursued both basic and applied research aimed at providing novel solutions to improve crop productivity. My work focuses on the soil because sustainable agriculture is only possible with healthy soil. And today, soils across Africa and in many parts of our world are in decline. Only with healthy soils can we grow health, nutritious crops. And only with good agricultural practices can we keep our soils healthy. I work with beneficial soil microbes. I have evaluated their potential to promote crop growth, to enhance the ability of plants to tolerate stresses caused by climate change, and to contribute to healthy and resilient ecosystems. Technology, innovations, and products based on beneficial soil bacteria offer environmentally sustainable approaches to improve crop productivity under a changing climate while restoring our degraded soils. This research has resulted in the issuance of two US patents, research funding of $2 million, and to partnerships with companies interested in commercializing products from our discoveries and inventions. Given my own life experience, I'm also dedicated to motivating others. And so I often speak to audiences of young people on the need to find sustainable solutions to hunger and food insecurity. As a result, many students and ordinary citizens have been inspired and motivated, and they are taking action against hunger and food insecurity. Back in Kenya, I'm also working with farmers through Oyeska Greens, a local startup social agribusiness that I founded with members of my community. But most importantly, 
I'm humbled to be passing on the sustainability torch to the next generation through Dr. Ndumi Faulu Academy, a school that I founded with my parents. My life's ultimate goal is to transfer all the knowledge gained from my research to developing countries. I look forward to the day when I can train African farmers in the use of new soil microbial products that are suited for their farms. Through peer-reviewed research articles and opinion pieces, I will continue to urge African countries to move faster in understanding, harnessing, developing, and patenting soil microbial inventions, and using these game-changing solutions to revolutionize African agriculture. I will push for this sustainable movement that begins from the soil, to the lab, to the farmer, and to you and I, to feed ourselves sustainably. I will keep inspiring and mobilizing people to take action against hunger and food insecurity, and to ensure a future of healthy, nutritious, food for the world's growing population. This, arguably, is the world's most pressing sustainability issue. I want to take an opportunity to thank my mentors that have held my hands through my career. I'm grateful to my parents, Mr. and Mrs. Harrison Gumbi, and my family in Kenya for inspiring me to reach for the stars. To my many friends around the world, I say thank you. Thank you to Auburn University, Aspen Institute New Voices, Clinton Global University Initiative, American Association of University Women, Slumberger Foundation, and World Food Prize for believing in me. Finally, I dedicate this award to all the dreamers out there, to the young researchers and students. Keep dreaming, work hard, and always aim for the stars. Thank you, thank you.